Hello everyone. Welcome to Bond Points by Another Points. I am Mikhil. In today's market, uh, the set yields are at 6.72, slightly up uh, than previous close. As the market uh, participants await for the RPI's announcement on the coming week auction is auction. And uh, and majorly the Russia Ukraine uh, geopolitical tensions are uh, keeping the uh, investors nervous. And as uh, as there is uh, no clarity on uh, what's going to happen. And as the equities today, the Sensex and Nifty closed on a negative note, and uh, the European markets are also trading uh, on a negative note. However, uh, the US markets are short for today, and uh, which is why the UST is also at, uh, uh, at the previous levels of 1.93%. And in the currency space, uh, we have uh, uh, UST INR pair are slightly below 75 levels and marginally up. And, uh, uh, and the local uh, assembly polls are also weighing on the investor sentiment in domestic markets. And in the global news, uh, we have uh, uh, German uh, producer prices uh, growing at the faster rate uh, in the month of uh, January, January 2022, which also shows that uh, the, the higher inflation levels are likely to persist in the coming months. And uh, uh, the, uh, the Russia and Ukraine are the biggest exporters of the wheat. And, uh, and as the as uh, the Russia Russia right now currently occupied the the eastern part of the Ukraine and which also has the trade routes of the Black Sea. Those are all stopped due to the current uh, uh, high military activities there, which also could uh, slightly put uh, higher uh, food inflation uh, in the coming months, especially in the eurozone. All in all, uh, the inflation is likely to uh, raise or at least stay at the previous uh, reported levels of five percent. Thank you for listening in and do check out our uh, uh, Quick Invest app by NR Bonds, which is available in both the uh, uh, Play Store and App Store. And use our filter smartly to uh, search the bonds of your name. And do subscribe to our uh, YouTube channel if you have not done so. And thank you for listening.